Well, let's start with the latest from Iran. At the International Atomic Energy Agency, spokesman has confirmed that, that Iran's stock of low enriched uranium has exceeded the maximum limit set under the 2015 nuclear deal. According to the IAEA reports, uh, Iran's stocks of low enriched uranium has exceeded the 300 kilogram limit. Iran's Foreign Minister Mohammad Javed Zarif had earlier said that Iran has breached the limit of its stockpile of low grade uranium set under the 2015 deal with the world powers. Enriched uranium is used in nuclear reactors. Under the deal now, Iran had agreed to limit the nuclear program in return for lifting of international economic sanctions. However, Iran continues to produce enriched uranium even after U.S. imposed fresh sanctions. What did you do? This is what you do. Israel has to call for automatic European sanctions on Iran over uranium breach. Benjamin Netanyahu has demanded that Europe must impose automatic sanctions on the country for accumulating more low enriched uranium than permitted, calling it a clear violation of the 2015 nuclear deal. Netanyahu said that Israel will not allow Iran to develop nuclear weapons at any cost. Israel has accused Iran of uh, pursuing a nuclear blackmail but said that uh, international pressure could just cause Tehran to back down. As per reports, there exists a mechanism under the nuclear agreement to deal with inconsistencies via a joint commission of signatories to decide on future action. Meanwhile, the White House has said that Iran should be held accountable for exceeding their uranium stockpile. They say the Islamic Republic needs to be held to a standard of no uranium enrichment, maintaining that the U.S. policy of maximum pressure on Iran will continue until it changes course. The White House has also reiterated that maximum pressure on the Iranian regime will continue until its leaders alter their course of action it plans to restore the long-standing non-proliferation standard of no enrichment for Iran. Maximum pressure on the Iranian regime will continue until its leaders alter their course of action. We must restore the long-standing non-proliferation standard of no enrichment for Iran. Well, that's what was being said. As for Trump, when asked by a reporter at the White House if he has a message for Iran, Trump clearly said that Iran is playing with fire.